Hey guys, AK James 762 again. This is a also a post range review. I finally got the SAS 12 to the range too. Um, I have absolutely no complaints about this firearm. It performed fabulously. It performed amazing. Exceeded my expectations, at, just like the M11 did. The way that this that this semi-automatic shotgun is designed is it doesn't really function well with low brass low brass doesn't really it doesn't cycle the bolt all the way back which is understandable I've heard that about Sega's and other uh, semi-automatic shotguns too the uh, the low brass it just whenever uh, you shoot a low brass out of it it gets the bolt back to about right here it doesn't cycle it all the way so it can't eject the spent shell and chamber a new round it just I guess it just doesn't have the power but I was uh, shooting Federal High Brass, I think it was number four or number six shot, perfectly. That's what I was shooting in the video. It cycled perfectly, no issues whatsoever. The only issues I had were with the low brass. I was the, the, It was a Winchester number eight shot low brass target loads. I had one stove pipe with those, and I had to uh, rack the bolt every time. With after the stovepipe, it just wouldn't, you know, that they just didn't have enough recoil to chamber the next round, which, like I said, is understandable. So, I know from now on to just shoot high brass out of this. And this does have a two and three quarter inch chamber, it doesn't have a three inch chamber like traditional 12 gauges. So, when I tried to, I loaded a three inch shell in the magazine and wasn't paying attention and I'm wondering why it wouldn't chamber. And I'm like, oh, yeah, it's only got a two and three quarter inch chamber, so you can't chamber three inch shells. And I'm glad that uh, I had the smarts to put it in the magazine and not directly into the chamber. So be familiar with your gun. And uh, like, like I said, if I would have put it directly in the chamber, it could have been catastrophic. I don't know. I probably could have destroyed the gun. But I put it in the magazine, and it didn't feed from the magazine into the chamber. Took it out, diagnosed the problem, figured it out. Okay. Everybody stay safe out there. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Take it easy.